Assessing stands and wheat for spring management. The first step is to measure the row width. Next, determine the number of stems per square foot. We will discuss two methods for estimating plant populations. One strategy is to count the stems in a foot of row and use an equation to determine the number of stems per square foot. With the other method, you count the number of stems in a length of row equal to one square foot. For the foot of row method, count the number of stems in one foot and use the following equation, number of stems per foot times 12 divided by the row width. I recommend digging up the plants to separate and count the stems. This is much easier than trying to count them while still in the soil. The other method requires you to know the length of row to equal on square foot, based on the row width. This chart provides the row length for some common row widths. The weed in this picture is planted at 7.5 inches apart. To get the number of stems per square foot, count the number of stems in 19.2 inches. I keep a yard stick marked and labeled with the length of row required to equal one square foot for different row spacings. The wheat planted at this stage will have a main stem and tillers. In this picture, there is one main stem and two tillers present. We want to count all of the stems that are likely to produce a head and contribute to yield. There is one plant with three stems. Assessing the stand in late winter can help drive management decisions for the spring. If there are less than 15 plants per square foot present, maximum yield will not be reached and consideration should be given to planting another crop. If there are less than 60 stems present, I recommend a nitrogen application before green up to encourage further tiller development. Consider a split nitrogen application with 40% at green up and 60% before joint. If there are greater than 60 stems per square foot present, apply nitrogen before joint. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me or your local Pioneer sales representative. Thank you and happy farming. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.